All right, so I'm gonna be doing a quick video on how to open up this Lenovo C440, um, just for like hard drive or SSD upgrade. So anyways, you just lay it on the screen, hopefully on a soft surface, and then you pull on this cover. You'll, you might need two hands, so you can pull on both sides here. I'm gonna try and do it from the middle just because I'm holding my camera or my phone, but you basically pull this cover down. I guess I can't do it from there, so I'm gonna pull from here. Um, Okay, you can see it comes out like that. So usually you'd want to do both sides at the same time um, I'm just using my fingernails, but some people they'll be like they don't have fingernails So I mean you can let them grow out or just get some pry tools All right, so pull that out once you pull that down you can lift this up. All right, just like this you Might have to wiggle it around a little bit, but there we go Come on. Why is it stuck? There we go. Okay. It's hard to do this with one hand but uh, I don't have a good camera set up for this kind of thing. Anyways, here you can see the hard drive is right here. To take it out, you just pull this blue thing forward, and then you can lift this up if I remember correctly. I haven't done one of these in a while, so I'm not 100% sure. Let me see. Actually, okay. You pull this clip up so that it unclips, and then you have to pull it, slide it over, it looks like. <laughs> Man, I can't do this with one hand. Uh, let me see. I don't think there's any screws to take out here. Yeah, it does latch, so you do have to pull this up so that way it unclips. And then while it's unclipped, you slide it. Yep, you slide it over to the right. Just like that. And here's the hard drive connector. Since I'm going to put a 2.5 inch SATA hard drive, I'm going to plug the hard drive in here and then I'm going to put some tape over it to hold it in place. Um, and then here you can see the RAM. So I'm going to pop this out. There's actually two slots, but only one slot is filled. So I'm going to just pop this out just to show what it looks like. Again, this is hard to do with one hand. Normally you use two fingers on each hand and then pull it up like that. And then the RAM, it comes out at an angle like this. And here you can see it is PC3L 12800S. So it's 4 gigs. So you can get a matching 4 gig stick. Or you can get two 8 gig sticks if you want. But anyways, to put it back, put it back at an angle like that. Make sure it's in all the way and then push it down. And that's pretty much all there is to this. If you want to put another one of these types of hard drives, you can. You just pull this to the side and then you can pull the hard drive out. So there's these metal pegs that go into the little screw holes. So you have to pull that out to put that. And then again, I'm going to just put an SSD down here. You just slide the connector in smaller parts here and then the wider part of the connectors here so just slide the hard drive in and then use tape and hold that hard drive in place and then of course once you're done you just take the cover get it back underneath okay just like before get that in like that and then you just slide it up okay i'm not going to push it right now because then i'm going to have to take it back out and it's hard to do with one hand but you get the idea you just slide the clips back in place and that's pretty much it. Hopefully this video helped you guys. If it did, please like and subscribe. Help others find my videos. And thank you for watching. Bye.